Kendrick Nicholson, Connor O'Donnell, the referees, Justin Johnson, Matt McPherson, the linesmen. Ottawa and Montreal for the first time this season, and away we go on Hockey Night in Canada. Here's Paul, long pass ahead. Off the stick of Sanford, drop back, Connor Brown with a first shot, and it's into the glove of Andrew Hammond. Cross for Artem Zoom, and he'll get it to center. Kachuk trying to break down the wing, couldn't catch up to the puck. Kulak sends it around, and there's Pitlick to hand it off at center. The Ottawa Senators have been playing much better hockey since the end of November, beginning of December. Here's Nick Paul with a shot, steered aside by Hammond. Caulfield up through center, and it knocked off his stick. Zub will play it ahead, and now it's brought in by Parker Kelly to call in White with a shot, put it right off the iron. Chances at both ends of the ice to get this one going, depending on how Colin White is playing. In his first two shifts, he looks really good. Alex Formanson going after him. He'll take the hit from Gallagher. Icing waved off as Zub is there, trying to get it up for Brandstrom. Checked by Pazetta. Pazetta around the goal, hangs on, and a high shot knocked down by Murray. Pitlick into the forecheck, helps the turnover as Luckinett tried to get it to the goal. Jake Evans is on it. Evans back to the point for Sherrod, thrown through traffic, blocked in front by Stutzla. Dumped in behind the net as Evans is there, rolled it around for Sherrod. Throw towards it at Murray, the stop, big rebound, Romanoff goes after it, got there before Connor Brown. He's all right as he took out Hammond in the process. Now Nick Suzuki jumps on it, in front for Caulfield, and Murray makes the stop. Schooneman throws it on goal, Murray will play it off for Nick Holden, including a penalty shot goal. I, I think it was one of his best games of the season uh, against the Buffalo Sabres. Now I know not an incredibly strong opponent, but at the same time, I thought he looked the best I've seen him look in a while. 2016-17 season, where they did that March to April. But from Mete, hands it off. Brandstrom fires right on. Tierney right back in front again. Pitlick inside. Great save made by Murray. Got the pad across and on Turi Lekkinen. Sherrod through traffic and Fox scores. Lekkinen makes it home. He's scoring points, but defensively, penalty killing. A guy that can move up and down the lineup, but some turnovers along the wall. A puck that went to go up the wall, I believe, by Tierney. Hits a leg and bounces out to Lekkinen. And then that's the first chance. And then eventually it rotates back to Sherrod. He lays it to the net. They can't contain him. Mette. Throw to the point. Josh Brown with a shot. Tipped in front. Great chance for Nick Paul. Here's Sanford. Backhand blocked by him and loose puck in front. And Hammond will cover it up. It's been since February 7th since he's had his last goal, and it was a good backhand shot to the net, and then Sanford picks up the loose puck, searching out 50-50 pucks. So a 33-minute game for him at this juncture, and this is a guy whose, you know, average minutes are probably, you know, a little over 20, 21, maybe 22. This power play is brought to you by Kit Kat Chunky, made for hunger, now 30% chunkier. Connor Brown. We'll bring it in. Throws it in front, scores! Colin White, welcome back! In the offensive zone, down below the, down below the circles. Good rush by Matt Day. He feeds it off to Brown, who takes it down deep into the zone. And when you take it down deep into the zone, you get to assess when the guys come in and who's open and where the best play might be. And all of a sudden, he picks his head up and who's wide open right in the slot? is white and he is wide open as you see montreal suzuki and romanoff are well outside the hash marks on the inside so white jumping in the hole brown finding him and we're all tied up at one break for hoffman coming in great stop by murray as hoffman tried to drag the puck back and murray kept the toe out really got things turned around their goaltending has improved drastically Dolpin makes a nice little shovel pass into the middle of the ice and Hoffman jumps right into it right there. And he pulls it in and decides to give it to Forsberg. Gambrell. Down in the corner, caught up by Kulak, lost the stick in front. Formanton with a chance. Hammond the stop. And Formanton will drop it back behind the goal. But hand it off for Schooneman. Rem Pitlick going after it. Formanton checks him. And now it's Jake Evans jumping up on the rush, going to the net. Great stop by Murray. In his own zone with a nice little shovel pass up the wall. 
And then into the middle to Evans with all that speed. Now you got to try to control that speed if you're Branstrom. And when do you turn? When do you pivot on that 45 angle? If you pivot too soon, maybe you can't get to him. And then when do you head? Good play by Cadet to clear it to center. Dumped right back in. That one got away from Murray behind the goal. Two up for Formanton. Bouncing puck. Scores! Arturi Lekkinen fires it in behind Murray for his second of the night, and it's 2-1 Montreal. And then this thing comes into the zone as it comes around. Zoop chips it there to Formanton, and he just takes a backhand stab at it. He doesn't really try to battle it out. You've got to stop that puck and battle it out of your zone. And it ends up, you're picking it out of your net. And a few seconds before that, it came up the wall to Stutzla, who came down the wall, and he didn't. He's got himself a pair, and nine on the year, and that ranks fourth on the Canadians in goals this year. Now Gallagher trying to get a handle on it. Hoffman in front. Dauphin gets knocked into the goal by Grandstrom. But at the end of the day, Murray makes a nice glove save through traffic and losing battles on the puck. Gallagher wins the battle on Brandstrom, and he comes back. And he sounds pretty good too. Uh, anytime I get a chance to sit with Mr. Irving and listen to the, the stories, it's just always so tremendous. Connor Brown will float the pass across for Ennis, coming off the bench from the change. Curls away from Petrie. Tyler Ennis to Connor Brown, going to the net, back in on goal, and Hammond has got it with a scramble in front. And he's really all by himself. Look at him sitting out there. Here comes the pressure from Petrie. He spins off, and then this little shovel pass into Brown. It just really settles things down, and then out to White in front of the net. And Hammond does a pretty good job of getting things tied up down there and doesn't let that puck bounce around. Batted away at center. White can't reach it. Hoffman catches up to it. Throws it in front. Gallagher along with a backhand. Murray the stop. For a loose puck in front of him. And Murray wins this battle. 2-1 Montreal. Hockey night in Canada. Now it's Evans. Down the wing. Checks up in the corner. Dropped it off. Gallagher fires. Big stop by Murray. And then Zub and Murray collide. Here you're going to see White who just cruises down. He's not really picking up anybody. And then all of a sudden, there's no way that Zub can get out to Gallagher. That is a player that White has to stop, look over his shoulder, and he has to stop, put the brakes on, and pick up Gallagher coming into the zone because there's no way Zub's going to get out that far on that side of the ice. If you get hit in the forearm or in that elbow area, your whole hand can go numb. Turnover, chance for Connor Brown, and Hammond makes the save. And, and then Chirac throws this to Caulfield, but it's on the wrong side of him, and it's a bit of a miscue. And Icing waved off, Josh Anderson is on it. Takes the hit in the corner from Brady Kachuk. Tries to run the clock out and they do it. The Canadians win their fifth straight game.